Okay, so my wife is preparing to um, fly to Seattle for tomorrow. Um, she's going out for, for our lovely daughter's uh, to, to help prepare for our lovely daughter's wedding, uh, which is next Sunday, I, th I think. I'm pretty sure. And, and I'll be flying out later next week. Uh, this is just kind of, you know, show how, what, what preparations can do for you. Now, my wife, and this will really be a testament to how wonderful a woman my wife is, or depending on how you look at it, how truly dysfunctional I am as a human being. Well, I don't want to try something. Look at that way. Back of my head, facing the fall. Oh, that's sweet. Anyhow, so yesterday, Friday, it was Thursday, I'm out doing whatever it is that I do on a daily basis. And she cleaned the entire house, mowed the front and backyard, explicit instructions. Hey, just make sure you're, you're cleaning up, you know, every day. <laughs> make sure the house is picked up. But this is the greatest because she's got me all set up. Let me turn the camera around. With my Phineas and Ferb costume Perry the Platypus folder. So that I know what I need to do every day while she's gone. Let's let's take a look in here. This is pretty cool. Actually I haven't looked in here yet. So we got receipts because I have to pick up a tuxedo um, when I get out. Well, actually, I get, ooh, she'll kill me if she heard that. I got to pick up the tuxedo here and then take it with me on the plane when I leave on Friday. Got my little uh, boarding passes. And then this is the piece de resistance. Piece de resistance. That's, that's French for uh, piece de resistance. So Monday the 12th, put out the trash. Oh, I got nothing else to do on Monday. That's awesome. Tuesday, the 13th. Pick up tuxes after school. Haircuts. That's for me and a boy. Culver's for dinner. Yay! Look at how she wrote that. That's freaking awesome. That's so funny. Wednesday, the 13th. Look, it's a blank page. Oh, man. I'm sure we'll put something on that. Something. Thursday, exchange meeting. It's in a local investor meeting we go to. Ruth and Dan launch. We're picking up uh, brother-in-law Dan. We're going to meet for lunch first, and then going to bring him here. He's going to hang out with us Thursday night. We're flying out on Friday, and I have to check in Southwest Online 2 p.m. And then Nick, my son, has open house that evening at school. And that's it for that one. She puts it on pink paper, too, what she's trying to say. I don't know. Friday the 16th. Nick School. Hey, thanks for reminding me of that, babe. Jojo boarding. Waterboarding. I'm going to waterboard our dog. Oh. My daughter just said, you're not flying Southwest. I'm flying United. That's right. Thanks. Either way. All right, so pick up Nick at 1030. Airport at 1110. So, I mean, that's just, again, like I said, just how wonderful, awesome my wife is because it's all... Clearly laid out for me because I can be both. Matter of fact, my son, uh, you know, likes to a lot of times he'll ask me to do something or you know remind me or something. He's like, make sure you write yourself a note, or he'll just write the note for me, uh, stick it on the door or the wall somewhere because uh, sometimes I for I forget stuff apparently. But anyhow, I just kind of wanted to do take this time to talk about the importance of preparation. And my wife is somebody who's wildly prepared for just about anything and me I'm you know I'm usually the guy that's getting dragged from the back of the truck hanging off of the rope long for the ride but whatever I'm fun to be around sometimes so that's what I got anyway talk to y'all later I think I got this figured out now hold on